In a bid to help commercial passengers, NASA has launched the skeleton for what could be a supersonic flight. The X-59 flights are expected to make a transatlantic crossing in as little as 90 minutes, a route that otherwise takes nearly eight hours long. So here's a report to save you on the jet lag. NASA's newest project can help flyers to get from New York to London in less time than it takes to watch an average in-flight movie. As a contrast, the fastest passenger jet till date is the French and British-made Concorde. It made its fastest flight in February 1996, cutting through the Atlantic in about 2 hours and 52 minutes. The Concorde jets were retired in 2003 after its first and only crash in 2000. The American Space Agency has announced its case for supersonic air travel the first of its kind. If the preliminary tests show promise, the craft will fly across the Atlantic at flaming speeds. The speed will oscillate between Mach 2 to Mach 4, dubbed roughly into 2,470 to 4,900 kilometers per hour. This champion feat is higher than the top speed of the US FA-18 fighter jets. Interestingly, two 12-month contracts have been granted to Boeing, Rolls-Royce and other to help build a technology roadmap. Earlier in the year, NASA dusted its X-59 quiet supersonic test craft. The aircraft was designed to muffle its own sonic booms and will serve as an inspiration for the new project. NASA's travel game changer is expected to fly tests later this year. NASA's ambition is to accelerate the flights from New York to London for up to four times as fast as the current record. The agency is eyeing a thick market of passengers in as many as 50 established routes, connecting various cities on ocean-crossing flights. As per reports, the agency is looking to quell the sonic sounds during takeoff and descent. NASA has confirmed to reduce the sound pollution and undertake this project with full responsibility towards the environment. The agency has also placed passenger safety at the apex of the new aircraft. Bureau Report, We On, World Is One.